In today's video I will show you how to do advanced level video editing in Filmora X like this. Hello video editors, I am Sali Ali, welcome to Sali Tutorials. Dude, before I start the video, I want to inform you about my other YouTube channel. Named Royal Sali. On this channel I bring standard content regarding mobile, computer and technology. I hope this channel of mine is also very helpful for you guys. I request all the followers of Sali Tutorials to support me on this channel too. Thank you all in advance. So let's move on to the video. Drag and drop your video into Filmora Media. Then drag this video to the timeline. I have video like this. This video is about 8 seconds long. Double click on the video. Go to the Animation tab and click on it, and then on Customize. Move the playhead forward one second. And add a keyframe here. And in this keyframe increase the scale, that is, increase the scale to 400. Move the playhead one second further. There is also a keyframe to be added. And to reset the scale in this keyframe. Move the playhead 3 seconds. Add a keyframe here. And scale 200 in this frame. And make the rotation 100. Move the playhead one second further and reset the scale and rotation in this keyframe. Okay. Next, go to the effects tab and click on it and find the TV wall effect inside the effect here. and apply it by dragging it over the video in the track below. And then drag and drop the basic blur effect into the track above it. Equalize the duration of the effect with the video of the track below. Go back to the media and drag and drop the same video into the top track. Move the playhead 2 seconds from the start of the video and split the video here and then delete the first part of the video. Remember you have auto ripple off. Now double click on the video above and here's a keyframe and reduce the scale in this keyframe so that this video matches the video frame of the video below so I kept the scale minus 33% I think if you also put minus 33% in this keyframe then this adjustment will be fine move the playhead forward one second and add a keyframe here and reset the scale in this keyframe
Move the playhead for another 2 seconds. Add an empty keyframe here. Move the playhead one second further. And add a keyframe here. And reduce the scale in this keyframe. So that this video matches the frame of the video below. So I kept the scale minus 33%. I think if you also put minus 33% in this keyframe then this adjustment will be fine. Keep the rotation 360 in this keyframe. Also keep the opacity 50 in this keyframe. Now place the playhead between the two frames in the middle. And add a keyframe here. And keep the opacity to 50 in this keyframe. Hope you find today's editing helpful. Please subscribe to the channel for video editing, effects and tips and tricks. And like the video. See you again with a new video. Bye.